And hello everybody and welcome back to the stream. Hope you're all having a fantastic Friday or whatever day it is for you right now. And uh, yeah, so here we are. So disaster struck this morning in that I, uh, I spilled my breakfast all over myself. And so the external keyboard I was using the past almost a year uh, is, is dead and gone. I, uh, I'm keeping its little USB port as like the soul of it, like, uh, you know, keepsake. But otherwise, that that uh, that little external keyboard is now gone and dead. It does not work. Uh, liquid got into it, and the buttons do not function properly anymore. But the stream is not cancelled. Because fortunately, I have a comically oversized external keyboard meant for a desktop. Uh, and this comically oversized keyboard is, like, literally so big that it's Lengthwise, it is larger than the laptop. It is very funny and also very awkward when like sitting anywhere but at this at this desk here. <laughs> it's a uh, very unfortunate. Luckily, by next week I'll have another normal size external keyboard, so that'll be fine. So we 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 can continue with the stream as normal today and tomorrow. And if you haven't been around since then then uh, maybe you do not know, we are on Kindergarten 2, having a good time with this game. Uh, Kindergarten 3 is coming out later this year, and there's not a lot of the year left, so we're trying to do both the Kindergarten games so we can, you know, catch the hype train when uh, the third one comes out. And I do genuinely like these games. They're very, very funny, very imaginative. And they force me to make stupid noises that uh, are absurd. But yeah, so we're like halfway through Kindergarten 2, something like that. We've done like four or five of the missions. I'd be shocked if we've done six. I'm pretty sure we've done at most five. So we're like halfway through the game, but uh, yeah. So we're just gonna try and get back into it. And if we can't figure anything out, then there's always Monstermon because we we finally got enough cards to make a Monstermon deck. And I have this nice uh, red focus deck that might uh, be interesting to try out because uh, that's of course not a completely silly thing to worry about, um, a fake ECG inside a game, but uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna try and hopefully use this comically oversized keyboard correctly. Uh, it's my fingers are definitely gonna be off quite often, but yeah, so I'm not gonna also, we're not gonna have Tara's help with uh, figuring things out, but we'll make do. So I hope you all have a good time and that you have a good time tonight. And so let's uh, try and get back into this game here. All right, let's go. All right, okay, cool, cool, cool. Please load. Please load. Yes, it's loading. Very good. All right. Oh, wow. Wait, have we done six? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. Well. We have done more than I thought we'd had. Okay, the America costume was funny the one time. More progress was made than expected. Correct. Um, you know, we'll just have a normal head, but with the America shirt, because why not? Yeah, if we go over here, we have a we have like a red matters deck here. Like, um, most of it is red matters. I had to do a few fill-ins. Like right here is if you discarded a red card, uh, red, red, red. You have all red in your hand. So yeah, I have like a few fill-ins, but mostly it's a red matters. It's a red matters deck. Red deck win persists forever. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, we'll see when we go and we try and play. But okay, let's uh. Oh my god, the escape key is so fucking far up. I hit the I hit the tilde key over and over again trying to open the menu. Holy fuck! Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. So yeah, we've done six. We have three left. These require a lot of stuff, though. These require a lot of stuff. These require a lot of stuff. Breaking sad. Things that go boot. This is the one with um Carla. We'll, do, we'll save that for second to last. So let's. How do we start breaking sad here? Start mission by annoying Miss Applegate. Once with Cindy and once by yourself. 
What? Okay. Uh, well, we need the chemical and we need the 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 shark. We need the blahage. Okay. Annoying Miss Applegate with Cindy, and by ourself. Well, okay. So we need this. And this. What the mission says we need. So I guess I'll just take those and not try not to worry. Otherwise. So uh yeah, let's uh let's let's go. I guess. Oh, it's you. How's uh how's it going? Are you okay? I'm I'm just great. A little tired maybe or something. You wouldn't happen to have any of those pills you had yesterday. Nope. Then stop bothering me. The pill hasn't run yet, so I don't have to put up with you right now. But I No! Not today! I'm so close to snapping right now and I'm gonna need all my energy for when Cindy causes an issue. Get out of my face! Let her get herself together. Oh. I don't even know what these items do. The shark and the... I know that shark is, was given to Nugget by Lily. This new school is so much more my style, especially the selection of new boys. I thought we were together. Sorry, honey, but we're yesterday's news. Besides, we both know I'm too good for you anyway. Ouch. Here's a tissue. Cry me a river. Now will you help me get a new boyfriend? I've got better things to do. Um, I don't know if the tissue is what we need. Um. Okay, hold on. I think I need I think I need to do something slightly different. I think I need to talk to Cindy in a different fashion. Is that the sound of her slapping me? I disagree. You're pretty awful. Easy there, leftovers. We want there to be another domestic dispute at our new school, would we? I'm always ready for a domestic dispute. Good, so am I. <laughs> no, I am not putting up with this today. I am way too tired and dizzy and, and your behavior will not be tolerated. Ow, hey, stop it, that hurts. Miss Applegate, stop. We do not physically discipline our students here. We're all a little on edge after what happened yesterday, but please remain civil to each other just for today. Ha! <sighs> Fine! Just for today. Thank you, Miss Applegate. Go to hell, Cindy! You first, you washed up cow! Stupid Cindy. Always being awful. I'm gonna go inside and cool off. I'm about to freaking lose it. Maybe the lunch lady can make me a sandwich. Whoa, dude, that was impressive. What are you talking about? You really got into Miss Applegate's skin there. She looks like she's about to snap. So what? I will beat this child to death tomorrow. Mood. I'm just saying. One really ra loud noise or one more incident might completely break her. See if anyone around you has something. Thanks for the suggestion. I think that Carla girl has a firecracker or something. Should do the trick. Good idea. Carla, best girl. She even has explosives for us. Any contraband on you? Can you get stuff in? Well, if you want to get past things. Never mind. Okay, I have to ask Carla later, maybe. He said Carla has a... How do I get Carla to talk to me about the firecracker? Maybe I have to wait. Lighter battery hand sanitizer. Maybe I just, uh, eat the apple? What is it? Enter? Oh god, can I even find enter on this thing? Um... 
Um, okay, how do I get the firecracker, huh? You said that Carla might have it. Don't tell me I needed to bring, like, the laser or something, right? It didn't say I needed to bring the laser. Maybe I have to get into the smart class and talk- Okay, I think maybe I have to get into the smart class and talk to her. So we're gonna have to go back to the bedroom. If I can't get into the smart class, if I can't talk to her by getting in the smart classroom, though, then we'll have to try the laser. See if anyone around here has something. I think Carl has a firecracker. Oh, oh! Are you serious? Okay. Oh, really, new kid? Here's a firecracker. I'll owe you a favor if you can get it in undetected. Deal. <laughs> this ought to be good. I'll see you in study hall, new kid. You have a lot to learn. We'll see about that. So I need to I need the firecracker and I need to get it past Penny somehow. How do I get it past Penny? Do I just not talk to Penny? Let's see. Let's see if that's all we need. Wait, mommy! The new kid has contraband, I'm going to take it! Well spotted, thank you, Penny. We do not allow contraband in my school. You'll have to go to the study hall. Aw, oh, man. For the smart class. Okay, um, alright. So, we have to get it past Penny somehow. How do I get it past Penny? to be friends. Here, you could have this friendship bracelet. Uh, thanks. It looks so good on you. I'm glad we're friends. I'll see you around. Alright. Okay, now that I have the friendship bracelet, can I just get it past her? Maybe I can do this by getting around- by going through the handicap section, maybe. That's probably how, how I have to do that, yeah. In which case, I probably shouldn't have talked to Penny. Period. Uh, well, let's see what happens. Okay, yeah. Okay. Go to class. Okay. So I need to get... I need to, uh... Whoops, that's the mission map. I need to get up the handicap way. I don't know if I need to go back here or not, but I don't, I don't think I need the smart... I don't know if I need the smart class thing. Um... Hmm. Maybe it... Okay. I just have to get around the handicap ramp, I think. I think that's all I have to actually do.
to get to the handicap ramp. I see. Maybe we, well, maybe we can work something out. Like what? I'll tell Bob over there you're pushing me up the ramp for $3. Sound good? Sure. Yep. Pleasure doing business with you. It always is, Monty. Hey, I need that kid I was just chatting with to push me up the ramp. Oh, alrighty then. Go on by. Alright, I think this has to be how I do this. Oh! Oh, cool. Alright. Can I just go to class here and then just, like, start here? Maybe I... Wow! We're all that stands between chaos and order. Do you understand? Yeah, bro, I get it. It's all monitoring. It's not a big deal. Not that big of a deal. We're gonna take this serious... <gasps> Student in the halls before the bell. Study hall, study hall. Jeez, you're in, you're way into this all monitor thing, aren't you? This is your chance to prove yourself, rookie. Take this kid to the principal's office. Fine, I'll take care of it. Go monitor downstairs or something. Look, man, I don't really care that you're up here. That little dweeb can fall down those stairs for all I care. He seems a little uptight. No kidding, just stick to the little... Just stick... Uh, to the little jerk. Why do you take this? It's good through morning time. You can't do much while you're carrying it. Thanks! Now let's get you back outside. Come on, dude. Don't come back in or Stevie will totally flip. Oh, never mind. Just head down to class. Gotta move on. What? What? She can still take it? What? Yes, that item in your pocket is not allowed in that school. I'm sorry, you'll have to report to study hall after lunch. How did you know that? What? I was just- I don't know how- Oh, wait, wait, we can get her doll! I think we can get her doll. I think we can get her doll, actually. So, let's restart morning time. Oh, wait, that, no, no, no. Restart schoolyard. Okay. Talk to Carla. Okay. Talk to Miss Applegate. Okay, so let's 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 do this whole thing again. I know this has to be the way though, right? Like I don't see another way of getting around Penny other than by going around like this. It's just that she still comes up the stairs if I go upstairs, so we're not going to go upstairs, obviously. But we need to do something else like this. Oh wow, the toys aren't even here. Wait a minute, could I find Miss Applegate, wherever she is? Okay. Can I just go into the classroom and eat an apple? Uh, why does the bell have to be so la- Oh, you're here early, somehow. You're definitely more eager to learn today than I am. I suppose I am. Well, take your seat and try not to bother me too much. My head hurts. Okay. Um, hello. You're the principal's daughter, right? I think I'm supposed to do something with you. Hello, Miss Applegate. It's lovely to meet you. I just noticed that the student snuck by without meeting me first, and... Oh dear, it appears that student has contraband. I'm going to have to take him to study hall. Study hall? Screw that! I'm not dealing with his nonsense today! Take him to the principal! Hey, the lights went out. I thought the school was supposed to be nice. Oh, wait, I died? Uh, oh. Oh, man, how do we... I don't know how to get around this. Oh, fuck, we're already fucked!
No, we can't. We can't be friends with Penny. How do I? What the fuck? God damn it! It's already Jover. Yeah, like I don't even. I'm. I've no fucking clue what I'm supposed to do here. Maybe. Okay, let's try the laser. Maybe I need to get. Pen I need to take Penny's laser and offer it. Maybe I need this. I need to offer this laser to Carla. Let's try that. A strange question. Okay, no. I think the laser is for Carla's quest. Do I have to go fucking look up a guide already? There's no fucking way, right? Wait a minute, what if we use the laser to... Not kill Penny, but like, fuck with Penny? Maybe that's a thing we can do? I don't know. We'll see. Wait a minute. What if I plant the firecracker? Oh, maybe I just plant the firecracker, actually. That might be a thing. We'll see in a moment. Maybe I just plant this. Oh no, it lo looks like I can't just plant it. Uh, huh, well... We go we hit the firecracker okay there we go i knew it okay well take your seat and try not to bother me too much my head hurts okay all right and so because we uh planted it we didn't have to uh so yeah it's not it's no longer jover <laughs> uh penny just didn't know we had it i guess Okay, kids, teacher has a headache, so we're going to be very quiet. It looks like this school has more f funding than the last one since there are actual toys. Go play and just be quiet. It's probably better that he does not have it. Okay. All right. Pop the firecracker. <laughs> I can't take it anymore! I hate teaching! I hate this new school! I hate children! I hate everything! <laughs> Nuggets saw teacher in the hallway! Why is teacher sad? She snapped. So Nugget is not craziest person anymore! Possibly. This pleases Nugget. Nugget will carry his new sanity status with honor. That's great, Nugget. Wow. Okay. Well, that was something. Too bad. Oh, wait. She's not here. I can just steal from Cubbies. Yeah. Oh, it's a blue card. Oh, whatever. Can I look at the monster mon- Oh, I can! We got this new blue card. 
Deal one damage or reflect a red monster mon. That doesn't work with my deck at all. Wait, wait, what, what, what was the flavor text? Hold on. It was raised by crabs and has adopted their style of living. <laughs> okay? Three dollars in here. I don't know if I need any of this. Um, so Miss Applegate snapped. Maybe I have to go talk to her. Let's 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 do that. Oh, hey, new kid. Say, you're familiar with that teacher of yours, right? Yeah, why? She seems to be having an um problem and that I'm not good in these kind of situations. I'll let you buy if you talk to her so I don't have to. Okay. Okay, cool. She's over there trying to break into the cafeteria. I'll see what I can do. It's not fair. I need them so badly. What's wrong? The pills. I haven't had any since yesterday. There aren't any anywhere. I'm losing my mind without them. No one has any? No. The supply chain completely broke down after the principal died. Even Monty said he... That's it? What? We'll have Monty make more pills. That little dweeb is so smart, I'm sure he can do it. And it would be good for his little side business. Okay... Okay is right. Get going. Go up that fa to that fancy classroom and ask what he needs to make her mama pills. Got it. Stevie! Yeah, yeah, I heard you. Good. Let the other deadbeat monitor know as well. Anyone who gets in this kid's way today is going straight up, going to be straight up murdered. Do you hear me? Okay, okay. Don't even know why we need hall monitors at this point. All you do is tell your kids to ignore me. Let me know what Monty needs. I'll head back to the classroom and wait for you there. I'll take care of it. Jesus Christ. Just go. I don't want to get murdered. Void is what I should have said. You <laughs> ever feel like your job isn't really all that important? I don't have a job. What the? You're not supposed to be in here, you stupid. You're a stupid kid. I need some pills. Yeah, me too, buddy. After what happened yesterday, the whole supply chain broke down. There aren't any left. Can you make some more? I'm trying to get the ingredients. Those rich twins' families owns the company that makes the chemical used in them. But without it, I can't make them. I have the chemical. What? No way! It looks like we're back in business. You're going to have to help me get some stuff. What do you, what do you need? I'm gonna need a chemistry set and a couple of hair samples from people who still have their stuff in their system. How do I get the chemistry set? It's right there behind the rope, but today's science lesson is about plants, not chemistry. We'll have to find some way to change it. Who has it in their system? Miss Applegate certainly does. By the looks of it, by the looks of her morning, she's going through some heavy withdrawal. Who else? Well, Nugget was obviously a pill popper. Wouldn't be surprised if he still had it running through him. That everyone? I heard a rumor that the principals of our last school was using kids to make them. I wouldn't be surprised if Billy had the key to the whole thing in his jeans. Where is Billy? You got me. I didn't see him or Lily this morning. Probably skipping after everything that happened yesterday. I'll figure something out. Oh, and if you're getting hair samples, I'd recommend using scissors. Plucking hairs could take forever. Got it. What are you doing in here? You're not gifted in any way. Get out. Out, I say. Is there even such a thing as as a Barack Obama impression? Because he just speaks with like this cadence of like a robot. But then when he wants to sound inspirational, he just raises his voice slightly. Like what even is an Obama impression? Hello, my fellow Americans. Like what? <laughs> Scissors. Go tell her what is needed. What did he say? Can he make the pills? We need hair samples. Of course! It must still be my system and nuggets! The Obama impression is when you start your sentence with, My fellow Americans. 
he did seem to say that quite often. Like, a lot. If, you know, from my own memory. But then, when, but then when he was on Hot Ones, like, in like 2011 or some shit, uh, he, he was very chill. Man, it's kind of crazy to think that... Wait, 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 no. He was president... No, no, no. He was president until 2016. No. I know that Trump was elected on the 16th... On, in the 16th... On 2016. Oh, yeah, okay. Obama was 08 to 12 and then 12... 12 to 16. I remember now. Oh wait, yeah, I know it was two terms. I just wasn't getting uh, it wasn't getting it correct in my head. So I get so when he was on hot ones in like 2014 or 2015, he was pretty chillax in the way he spoke. He wasn't he wasn't starting every sentence with "I fellow Americans." <laughs> Nugget front and center. What does the large teaching lady want of poor bleeding Nugget? I need a lock of your hair! Get over here so I can pluck a few! Nugget requires all of his hair! Teacher may not have any! Give it to me! No! Nugget will not give Teacher his hair! Oh god! <laughs> Attention new kids! Here's your passbook. If you get an adult to sign it, you're allowed out in the halls. Don't get any crazy ideas, though. You're only allowed to use it once per day. Got it. Ah, oh, yeah. Your teacher is otherwise occupied. Everyone head to the cafeteria for lunch. Go to lunch. Hey, kid. You got me thinking about this old pill thing, so I made a few moves after Dana kicked you out to the curb. What moves? I talked to that Carla girl. She's really well connected here. I like that in a woman. <laughs> oh, okay, so Monty is based. Okay, Monty is based as fuck. All right. Monty is now second only to Nugget. Officially. Oh, okay, he, it's Nugget, Carla, Monty. There we go. He is, Monty is based. Oh yeah, she mentioned that she saw some kids sneak through the sewer grate that Nugget was trapped in this morning. Who were they? She said she didn't know them. They were wearing blue and brown hoodies. I wouldn't be surprised if they were still down there. Could be Lily and Billy. Anything else? Well, you need to get down into the school. I can give you my elevator key, but I'm going to need it back by science time or else I can't get up the stairs. Got it. As far as getting that chemistry set, Carla said she could help us out. I paid half of what she wanted. You get the other half. Fine. I mean, I bought scissors. Am I not gonna have enough money to like do anything? Well, the other guy said someone would be coming to see me, but I didn't realize it was you. Did you manage to sneak that firecracker in? Yup. Interesting. I've never seen someone able to sneak contraband on their own first day before. Well, a deal's a deal. I'll hook you up with the chemistry set. Kept with it. Kept with a chemistry class. Thanks. No problem. Enjoy your chemistry class. Will do. We got the chemistry class. All right, all right. He gave me this pass key. Oh no. Hamburger. I bought a burger. Here you go! This elevator requires a key to operate. Use the elevator key. Tara mentioned burgies and I've been wanting a burger for three days now. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like every instance of me seeing any food in any media or game makes me want to eat it almost immediately. Like, if I saw a taco right now, I would want Taco Bell immediately. Oh, uh, wait, do we want to squeak the plushie? Oh, we might want to, actually. Oh, yeah, no, we definitely have to. Okay. 
This box looks interesting. I think I can hear something inside. Squeak the plushie. That's the signal. It's safe to come out. I don't know which one is which. Finally, I think I'll be waiting in there for hours. Who are you guys? Oh yeah, we should probably tell you that. Oh no, that's that's Billy. Okay. It's us, Lily and Billy. We've been spying in this new school. We just discovered a lot. You want to hear about it? I'm actually just here for a hair sample. A hair sample? From me? But I was being tested on yesterday. There's no way I can give you my hair. I need it. Well, too bad. Get out of here. I thought we could trust you since you had the secret plush, but I guess we were wrong. We'll fix the school all by ourselves. Okay, then. You better get going, kid. We can't let anyone coming looking for you and have our cover blown. Get going. Gotcha! Now, give me some of your hair, you little degenerate. I need it. I need it for my pills. Put Nugget down. Nugget will not give the tweaker teacher any of his beautiful hair. Ooh, I'm tempted. Does Cindy play Monster Mon? Aha! Ugh, this stupid girl won't give me a turn on the trampoline. I'm getting pretty annoyed. You want to battle? I suppose that'd be good a way to pass the time. My cute deck is pretty good. We get to test our red deck. Gain three mana if your last discarded card was is red. Okay. Can we gain? I wonder if we can gain more than five mana. It kind of has the appearance that we can't because it's all in one bar here. So we have to spend mana first. We want to like we want to like uh, spend two mana or something like that. And so we can reduce any monster mon's damage. We can reflect a green mon. Let's just let's just let's just damage. Minus one damage. That was still four. That was still three damage. That's a lot. Purple plush. Swap hit points? Oh, God. Swap hit points? Oh, no. I guess it's either this or black... So I either I swap health points or I get a Black Lotus, but I don't know if a Black Lotus really helps very much. I think I actually will, will block this. Oh shit, Million Head Hydra? Okay, um... Oh, it's, it's six damage if our hand is red. So let's just go, let's uh, spend our green here. Okay, that deals only one to her. Okay. She has one mana left. She might not have any reactions available. So, two damage. The problem is that if I use one of these, um, I might not have a hand of red. Because I don't have a hand of red, I wouldn't get six damage on Million Head Hydra. So I'm just going to take this damage. Oh, fuck, she drew a card. <laughs> well, she has one mana, so maybe this works. Minus one damage. Okay, five. <laughs> Deal one damage. Oh, yeah, no, I don't... Yeah, no, I don't care. Come on. Are you serious? Oh, my God. Okay. Oh. No reaction. Life is a resource! Okay, so this is also six damage for ha oh, fa having a full hand of red. Oh my god, you bitch! You annoying bitch! Fuck you, god! Die! <laughs> Jesus! Get a reflex for everything I had. How dare you beat up my cute cards! If I give you one, will you go away? Sure. Fine, here, now leave me alone. Okay. 
Man, she blocked so much. I mean, I did deal five damage to her one time, so like that's still pretty fucking crazy. Uh, <laughs> I want to do another one. <laughs> Maybe I don't know. Oh wait, 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 wait. Yeah, no, let's not give that to him quite yet. Let's fight Jerome. You want to battle? Yeah, I do! My yellow deck is filled with the coolest cards! It's better than anything you've got! Okay, well, let's see if red deck can win. Wow. So... I don't really remember if the color pie in this Monster Bond game works similar. I don't know how similar it works to Magic. Like, he has all yellow cards, which is white. Does that mean he's going to have Reflect against red, red, red cards? I don't know. Let's, uh... Oh, man. Let's tread water a little bit. Let's just uh, send in some a little bit of green. Wow, he discarded a four damage card. That doesn't seem very intelligent. Two damage. Wait, he said it was a yellow deck, but he's using red cards. You fucking lying motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Let's go! Reduce a red monster one. Okay, that's still three. That's still good. Nice. No reaction. Burn me out, buddy. Come on. Six damage. Oh, it's a blowout. Oh, it's a fucking blowout. Oh. Oh. Fucking bodied. <laughs> Darn it, stupid deck. I blame the golden dewdrop. He's not cool enough to be in my deck. You can have him. Thanks. I'm gonna get back to these swings. Are you looking to get on them? No. <laughs> Let's look at these two cards we just got. Maybe they enable new strategies. Golden dewdrop. He was not brought about by any sort of shower. Okay. Okay, so Eel Four. If your last discarded card is blue, oh, we have a revitalize here, huh? You have to you have to have used a blue card in on your last turn or on your last usage of a card. Block a purple monster. Mon That's interesting. So white. So like yellow here does have like this white theme of. Uh, except for the sheep here, <laughs> this is not very. This doesn't really make a lot of sense. It's a black lotus if you discarded a fucking red card. But like, yeah, like the healing here. This this is this is magic the gathering accurate. Oh hey, marshmallow. Oh, this is the swap hit points with your opponent thing. This is so weird. I wonder if there are monster mon cards that let us deal damage to ourselves. Like a death shadow. You know? And we would use this like a death shadow. It's also very controlling because you could, like, pass a bunch, let your opponent use up all their damage on you, and then play this. So that's very, that's very control-oriented. Marshmallow's Shadow. <laughs> Maybe I actually replace... Oh, man. I like this because this is a zero. This is a zero. This is a zero cost attacker, and it reflects. Oh god, reflect is crazy. This is just reduced by two. Let's um. Let's uh. I lost track of my keys and the key. My hands and the keyboard. Let's try this. Now, since we haven't gotten a new red card. Whatever you say, Ted. Bugger off, urchin! I'm not interested in playing with you. What about battling? Oh, please! My deck is filled with prestigious with prestigious and blue cards. Someone as poor as you doesn't stand a chance. All right, let's see. Let's see, motherfucker. Wow, this, uh... This is not a good hand. But I can't gain hit point. Oh, fuck. Oh, no! I wish I could just pass go. <laughs> Oh, do I really have to fucking just throw... Whatever, I guess that's what we have to do. Reflected? Ow. 
Actually, wait, no, this is great. This works with Marshmallow. Uh, so I can block a purple monster mon. Oh, but then I won't be able to use this for the Black Lotus. Which means I'm kind of fucked anyway. Let's just block it with uh, the lamb then. Chair of Spikes. I don't want to swap mana with my opponent. What the fuck? I could pass go again, though. Now, because I actually used mana, I can now pass go. Let's do it. Deal six damage. Ho, 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 ho. This is going to be a blowout. Oh, wait, no, he has no mana. This, this is a fucking landslide. This is a landslide. Holy shit. Holy shit! Gain three mana. So reduce any monster mon damage. Swamp. Reflect. Okay, I can't do anything about this at all. That's fine. One damage. Get fucking bodied! I fucking death shadowed him! Marshmallow's shadow! <laughs> Inconceivable! How could someone of your cast beat someone like me? If I give you a card, you won't mention this to anyone, right? Sure. Good, good. I won. Yes, victory is mine. Whatever, man. <laughs> wow, that fucking death shadow was so good. The marshmallow shadow. That was awesome, bro. Holy shit. Oh, and we got his Black Lotus. This is for a green deck, though. We have only two green cards, so we're not we're not using this. At least not for now. Like I'll probably try out. Like this is so stupid, but I'm gonna I'll probably end up trying out a bunch of different deck deck archetypes, probably. Especially since that death shadow thing was just so good. It was so good right there. He took me to one, and I just swapped when he had no mana. <laughs> um, we're on a quest. Okay, okay, let's just uh. Wait a minute, can we... Can we battle Carla? Nice! Get in line, gringo. It's still my turn to jump on the trampoline. You want to battle? Hehe, <laughs> sure, but I'm not getting off this trampoline. My green and red deck can take on anyone. Ooh. Cool. I want to play Monstermon now. Damn. <laughs> so, she said green and red deck. So, she, she uh, has no blue. We don't need to reflect anything. Wow, that is a waste. Bitches running gruel, oh no. So I could deal two damage to her. Or I can reduce the damage. You know what, no, what we, we have Marshmallow in hand. We just let this happen. We always just pass. Also, she might have a bomb, a bomb green card that, like, is, like, insane. All right. Oh, yeah, no, I don't give a fuck about that. Holy moly, I don't give a shit about that. So the problem with using Lamb with Cleaver... Wow, this sucks. I don't want to. I don't want to do any of this. Um, like gaining three mana doesn't do anything because I already have maximum mana, right? You know what? Actually, I don't know how this works. Let's see. Do I actually gain more than five mana? Oh, just blocked it. Okay, never mind. Nothing happened. One damage. No reaction. Whoa! Wait. Oh no no yeah well, yeah I spent one right. Swap mana. This doesn't do anything. I'm gonna pass. No, I can't. Yeah, okay, I have maximum mana. I can't pass. Oh, this sucks. You know what? <laughs> it was a one mana swap that amounted to fucking nothing. This is a blue card, you liar! I can't pass either.
You know, we're it's five to eight. This is this is a net of three. So we're gonna swap life totals. Um I don't wanna block this, because I wanna use Killer Eye next turn to kill her. So no reaction. I'm gonna be so pissed off if she has some sort of counter. Let's try it. Fuck! You bitch! Oh, million. <laughs> million head hydra, okay. That's a blue card, you lying bitch! God damn! Uh, yeah, you're dead now. I just kill you. <laughs> Fucking. Six damage, lightning bolt. Holy shit. The only one because I was distracted with bouncing. Whatever, just take this. This doesn't fit with my deck anyway. Now let me bounce. I'm done battling for today. You gave us a blue card. Cool. Coral that looks like a hand. Two, deal three damage, plus three damage if your hand is all blue. Friend of mine told me an MTG haiku. There, there's some cool, there's some cool custom in the Magic Gathering cards that, right, that used haikus as their as their uh, their rule text, which I thought was really cool. It isn't a hand, but it has been known to grab people, which is weird because Coral isn't supposed to do that. Lightning bolt your face! Lightning bolt your face again! Lightning bolt your face! <laughs> oh, that is fucking hilarious. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Okay. Hold on a moment. Okay. Uh, I think we can battle the dumpster lady, but I think it takes an apple. Yeah, no, we don't want to do that. What do you want? I'm trying to get his hair, but it's not coming out. I need something to cut it with. Will these help? You bet they will. Okay, Nugget, time for a haircut. No! Oh, God! There! See? Was that so hard? Now go play, or whatever it is you do. Nuggets hair! Nuggets beautiful hair! I said go to play! Here's that hair. I expect some pills by the end of the day. I also need your hair. Done! Here! Sorry to make the pills then. I also need Billy's hair. Billy? He's here? I thought he was skipping like he did yesterday. He won't give me his hair. The hell he won't! You march back right to wherever he's hiding and demand you he give you his hair. Understood? Yes. Good. Take these scissors and come back with that hair. Got it. And you better have, have enough to afford your lab fee. Ugh. Okay. Wait. No, what? Well, hold on. Maybe we can still do this. Oh, hello, child. So good to have a visitor. Say, you won't have to have any food on you. I've come to battle. Oh, you play with the talismans? Be careful, dearie. Some bad things can happen if you get all 50. Like what? Perhaps it's better that I don't tell you. Why don't we get to it then? It's been ages since my dark deck has seen any action. All right. I have no idea how I'm going to fare against a dark deck. Do dark decks block other dark decks? Let's see. Six damage. What are you going to do? <gasps> Six damage out of the gate. What? But I still win, though, because she has no reactions. <laughs> we just sent the giant bird spirit.
spells at each other, and I just happened to win. <laughs> that was a three-turn game. That was a three-turn game. <sighs> you won. Good job. I'll give you a card, but remember, having all 50 might not be such a good idea. Yeah, yeah. Ta-ta, then. Bye, dumpster lady. That was so funny. She just tapped all of her mana to deal eight damage on turn one. And then I, but, but I had two turns to play, so I just burned her for six twice. What the fuck? That was ridiculous. Okay. Evil Thwarter, beast. Gain three mana if your last discarded card is green. Oh, Golgari, huh? Block a yellow monster, man. He doesn't thwart evil, he's a thwarter who is evil. <laughs> That's like for a Golgari deck of some kind. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, no. Yeah, Stevie's not... Hey! You're not supposed to be... Oh, it's you. Still running errands for the crazy teacher of yours. Yep. Great. Go ahead. Don't know why they even bother having me. Bye, Stevie. I might not be able to do this, actually. I'm gonna be honest. This is Billy's head. It appears to have been removed from his body without his consent. Clip off a few hairs. Oh, it kills me. Whoops. Well, I got I got uh, her outfit. Or I got Billy's outfit. Uh, yeah, restart. <laughs> I. I still have the cards, right? Yeah, I still retain the cards. Okay. Uh, right. If I retain the cards, doesn't that sort of mean that I kind of, like, skipped on having an apple right there because I didn't open the gate? Bye, Lily. you get Billy's hair? Please tell me you did. I got it. Good. Just make sure you have your lab fee ready for science. I might be a little short. Then you better find some money in a hurry. Don't you have any? I'm a teacher. What do you think? Good point. So get looking. Okay, okay. Maybe I can just sell, like, the Blahage. Are you done with my elevator key yet? Yep. Good! Bring those hair samples to me in science class and we'll see if we can get this business up and running. Sounds good. No! Okay. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Morning time. That sucks. So what I should have done was uh, steal uh, Teddy's money.
All right. Oh, but I don't have the scissors now. do I get when do I get the scissors I think I get the scissors now. I think that makes the most sense. All right, let's do this again. the gym. I got it. It's three dollars, right? Don't with my elevator key yet? Yep. Good. Bring those hair samples to me in science class and we'll see if we can get this business up and running. Sounds good. Finally, just one more class, then I get to go home. Anyone who wants to pay the lab fee can go to the science classroom. Everyone else meet in the gym. Science class. Woo. Okay. My fellow Americans, welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about chemistry. That's odd. I thought it was about plants. Anyway, chemistry is an extremely dangerous subject, which is precisely why you'll be doing it, it, it today instead of me. Everyone take a turn on the chemistry set. Why don't you go first wheelchair board? My name is Monty, jeez. Everyone is such a jerk to the differently able around here. You're getting real sick of it. You got all the stuff I need? Yep. Good. We're in business then. Gotta get started. I do have a small problem. What is it? Everyone gets a turn on this thing. Very delicate process, so we need everyone to pass their turn. Sounds complicated. It won't be easy, but with a little persuasion, I'm sure we can get this done right. So what do I do? Here's some junk I didn't sell today. See if you can get everyone to give up their turn on this thing. What is this? Don't get your hopes up. It's not a real gem, but you might be able to fool someone into thinking it is. 
There's a green flower that grows around the back of the school. What's this? Just an odd doll. Something similar to the one the toy in the chest downstairs. I know how this is. I know what this is. I actually like mixing chemicals around. It's kind of nice. Here's a green flower. What? No! I'm allergic! Get that away from me! Hi, Dr. Daniels. I guess chemistry might be kind of fun. Maybe I could make some kind of perfume or something. You want this gem? My, 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 that looks so glamorous and expensive. Are you just gonna give it to me? Yep. Well, thanks, sucker. I'm out of this stupid school. <laughs> Cin Cindy, where do you think you're going? <laughs> don't speak to me, peasant. I'm rich now. I don't have to put up with any of you. If you're referring to that mineral you're holding, I highly doubt it's worth what you... La 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 la, I can't hear you. You're too poor. Isn't chemistry fun? I can't wait to mix all the stuff together. You want the stall? Oh, I don't think I... But I do. I do want her. I'm going to take her. I'm going to play with the stall. Uh, you're welcome. She reminds me of a better time. I... I don't know what's wrong with me this time. Um, I'm glad you like her. Please leave, leave me alone with that. I don't want to have a reaction. Fine. It's almost done. I just need to add a bit of that chemical. There's one problem. What is it? Um, I don't actually know which vial to mix it with. You go with purple, red, or green. Which, do you, which one do you think? I don't know. Maybe the teacher knows. See if you, if you can get him to spill on what this chemical mixes with. Okay. You'll get your turn on the chemistry set. Just be patient. What can you tell me about this? Ah, I see you've become good friends with Felix. This chemical truly is a wonder. What happens if I mix it with green? I don't know if I'm illegally allowed to tell you. Let's just say mixing the two can lead to some explosive results. So we don't mix it with green. What happens if I mix it with red? It'll create a sort of painkiller. Highly addictive. It also uses in helping the arm um, clinically awkward. Mix it with red. What about purple? <clears throat> same same thing as that as what happens with the green. Good to know. Mix it with red. Okay, here it goes. Yes, I think it worked. This looks exactly like the old pills. Nice going. Glad it worked. There you go, man. And there's more to come. With this going, we can restore the supply chain. We're gonna be rich. Good. You're gonna have this monster mon card for helping me out. Pleasure doing business with you. Ah, another day of learning concluded. Please don't break anything on the way out. Leave without breaking anything. <laughs> Nugget is just a gory mess. Where do you think you're going? You haven't given me my pills yet. Well, where are they? Where are my pills? Did you get them? Give them to me. Okay, here. You sweet, sweet drug of gods. Ah, you, you really are the best student I've ever had. Thank you so much. Glad I could, en I could enable your habit. I think it's time for me to move on. Move on? I really hate Cindy, and Nugget, and Bugs, and all the children here, except you. You're cool. Um, thanks. If I'm leaving, I think you should have this. What is it? It's a remote control for, her, uh, the principal's daughter. Whoa. Yeah, that's another reason I want to leave. Too many robots, too much responsibility. What does it do? There's only a few buttons on it. I think we could make her come to your location and disable her detectors and stuff. I don't know. I didn't really read the manual. Well, thanks, I guess. Yep, have a nice life. Stay in school. Don't do drugs. You know the drill. Do I, though? Poodles. Bye, Miss Applegate. Wow. Breaking sad. Help Miss Applegate get her fix. Wow. Wow. Jesus, we got seven cards in one run. In one mission. 
That was crazy. Oh, a new red card. Oh, man on fire. Deal two damage, plus two if your last discard card is red. Ooh. What can we, what can we remove? Sw yeah, we can get rid of this. That's, like a, that's a wonky control card. Okay, we have another red card. Red deck. Red deck. Okay. Red deck energy. Mission map. Let's see. So we need the A+, plus, the Blahage, and the Laser. A+, plus Blahage, Laser. Okay. I'm going to put on one of the jackets. I think this is awesome. I look so cool now. Holy fuck. How do we start this mission, by the way? Start the mission by giving Carla the laser. Okay. Simple is as simple does. Hey, you must be one of the new kids. I'm Carla. Do you have any contraband on you? Do you... Do you want this? What the... No way! Where did you get that? How did you get it? This is incredible! With this, I can finally... Finally what? Kid! Clear your schedule. We've got a lot of work to do. What are you talking about? With this laser module... And with that other principal's kid transferring, I can finally go through with my little project. Which is... You see, I'm pretty good about getting around this school. I've got keys, secret passages, and I know how to tangle with Stevie. Okay. One problem I've never been able to solve is getting a passage from the teacher's lounge to the janitor's closet. How does the laser help? On its own, it doesn't. But I heard about the stuff that went on at your school. There was a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That place was a train wreck. I'm talking about the little pocket bombs that listened in, listened to your conversations. The little pocket bombs? Oh, I remember now. I remember this. Oh yeah, those sucked. I need one, and you're going to get it for me. You're friends with that crying kid over there, right? Not really. Well, you're gonna be. Find him a tissue or something. Maybe you can cheer him up and he'll give you one of the those devices. Worth a shot. Go away, kid. I don't want to talk about it. You look like you could use this. Thanks, man. I can't believe they made me come to school today. Why? What's wrong? I'm not going to tell you. You know what? What's the difference? Do you know why we're at this school instead of our old one? Yes. You do? How did you find out? I only know because I found the body parts. Jerome's about to murder us for saying this, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm the one who did it. You. You what? I did it. You know what? Here, take this. Is that one of your dad's? I know where Billy is. Oh no. See you in hell. I guess you will. Jerome might be a little mad that you helped kill his father. <laughs> ah, uh. Um, it was on the news. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. So you know what I have to do then, right? Find a foster family? I have a mom! Jeez, I have to take revenge on who did this to my family. Who do you think did this? Lily, obviously. She was obsessed with my dad. It had to be her. She's not even here. That's what you think. I know she's here. I can feel it. Can you help me find her? Please, I need justice. I guess I can help you. Thank you. Now I just need a lead of some sort. Talk to Nugget. He was close to Billy and had a crush on Lily. Maybe he knows. Okay, then. You want this? So, you best friends with the crybaby over there? He wants to find Lily. Hmm, she was the girl whose brother went missing, right? Interesting. You know, I did see two kids sneak into the crawl space under the school. Could it be them? 
I would it wouldn't surprise me. Since that Nugget Kid caved in my secret passage this morning, we need another way to get down there. What are our options? I say we go through that grate. Here's a screwdriver. Let that Nugget Kid out. I'll distract Bob so he doesn't notice it's open. Why don't we just get Bob to do it? Because Bob will put the grate back on. We need to we need it off if we're gonna get down there. Okay then. Help! Nugget is trapped! I'm gonna get you out of there. Nugget is free! Thank you for freeing Nugget. No problem. Nice job, kid. So this is Nugget, huh? It is. Yes, Nugget is Nugget. Who is Ponytail Girl? I'm Carla. Say, you wouldn't have, have happened to see anyone down there. Perhaps some kids in hoodies? Uh, Nugget is not supposed to say. Only trust those with the secret stuff creature. Hey, no! Right, the secret... I've heard enough. You mean the smart class, kid. We've got work to do. My fellow Americans, please try to use this time constructively. Good, you're here. We need to get down to that crawl space to confirm that if the girl is here. How do we get there? Why do you think I had you open that grate? Oh yeah. It'll be easy enough. Here's the key to the door that will lead you to the handicap ramp. Let's take our assessment so Dander lets us out. Coming with me? I'm only following you downstairs. I'll make sure Stevie doesn't stop you from using that key. Got it. Take the assessment. Okay, let's go. Dan probably won't stop us now. Carla is like the most competent person in this whole series. And just where do you think you're going, my fellow Americans? The bathroom? Together? No. Okay, just don't cause any trouble. <laughs> that was funny. You going to the bathroom together? No, just ignore that we're leaving at the same time. Hey, the boys' room is downstairs. He can go down, but you can't. Relax, man. The student handbook says I'm allowed to assist a new student with finding the bathroom. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. Thanks. My pleasure. Wow, that guy is dumb, but Stevie isn't. Once he sees us, he'll take me back upstairs. Then what? While he's doing that, use that key to get out before he comes back. Got it. We need to be back in class before the bell rings. I'll make another distraction for you so Stevie doesn't come in from outside. Just don't be late. Good, let's go then. Hey, Carla, you're not supposed to be downstairs. The girl's bathroom is upstairs. Better than one that should have stopped you. Oh, that's right, silly me. Maybe you should walk me there to make sure I don't make any more mistakes. Don't play dumb with me. Come on, let's take you back upstairs. I actually forget what I'm supposed to do, kind of. Um, I have to use the screwdriver? Oh, we have to go to the handicap ramp. That's right. I remember now. Being out here at this time of day is uh, very weird. Weak. It's us! It's us, Lily and Billy! We've been spying on this new school and we discovered a lot! Do you want to hear about it? Actually, you know what? We could just say sure and just... Well, I don't know. Jerome is after Lily. Me? Oh, I guess he blames me for what happened to his dad. Yep. Oh, we should have seen this coming, Billy. What's the big deal? He can't get to us. He doesn't even know we're here. We can't risk it. I have to confront him. He has to know the truth about his father. Head back upstairs and tell Jerome to meet me in the girls' bathroom. Knock on the first stall twice. Wow. 
Okay? Okay, then. I only have one apple. So I'm nervous about this. Get back to class before the bell rings. You don't want to get to study hall. Hey, Stewie, is my friend still in the... Unacceptable, call. I'm giving you study hall. You're not supposed to be down here. Come on, man. I'm just checking on my friend. He's fine. See, now get back upstairs while I send you to the principal's office. Okay, fine. Jeez. And you. You've had long enough for your bathroom break. Back upstairs, now. Good, you're back. I'll take that key. So what's the deal? Are those kids down there? Can we get Jerome to them? They'll be in the girls' bathroom. Good, let's tell the crowd it'll be the good news. Let's go. Did you find anything about Lily? Do you know where she is? She'll be in the bathroom during lunch. Oh, she is here. I knew it. I'm going to get her for what she did. Thanks, kid. I have a plan to get you there. We'll talk during lunch. My fellow Americans, I hope you all learned something today. Please go to lunch. I need to get upstairs to that bathroom. I got some extra burgers like you asked. What are, you, what are they for? Steve, you got a little extra irritated with me today, so now I have study hall. I'm not going to the principal's office for all this. But what can we do? We're going to start a food fight. It'll draw all the monitors, give you a chance to leave. We just need someone big and dumb enough to start it. Sounds good. Okay, then you just need to find someone willing to start it. Once it starts, there should be enough chaos for you to get out of here. Got it. One more thing. While you're upstairs, get into the science class and change the lesson plan to robotics. I'm going to need some of that stuff to finish our little project. Got it. Burgers are okay, but I actually kind of missed a slump. Want to start a food fight? <laughs> yeah, I do. This place could use a little redecorating. Look at Nugget's face. Let's do it. Easy there, kid. I'm not starting to fight without proper ammunition. You want more food? Yep, bring me more burgers. We'll kick this food fight off right. You get it mine. How many do you need now? One more should do it. Go get one. Hurry. Got that burger for me? Here you go. Let's get this show on the road. Hey, Nugget! Nugget does not wish to speak to... Catch! Nugget does not like burgers! Hey, Fatso! Watch it! You almost hit me with that grease ball! Oh, my mistake! I'll make sure to hit you this time! Oof! Hey! That was rude! Come on, weird kid! We don't have to put up with this! Let's give him a taste of his own medicine! Nugget had never considered throwing food back at the nasty bully! Nugget normally just poisons his enemies! But Nugget can make an exception this time! Ugh, what the heck? I don't want to get involved in your stupid... FOOD FIGHT! Unacceptable! This will not stand in my cafeteria. <laughs> ah, perhaps I should get my sister. Awesome. What are you doing? Lily's in hiding in there, Ben. Oh, yeah. Okay, whatever, dude. Ugh! Ugh! Wretch! Occupied! I'm not gonna bother her. Knock on the stall. Hello, hello, Jerome! Lily! You! You! You killed my dad! Now I'm gonna do what he should have done! I'm gonna stop you and your crazy conspiracy theories! Jerome, wait! I can explain everything! Liar! I know we're bit. He's not lying. What? Of course she's lying! She's just trying to save herself! Jerome, did you ever stop to consider why your dad had explosives and why they blow up when you mentioned my brother? Shut up! 
I'm sure there was a reason. It's because you're unstable. He knew you were after him. Yeah, because he kidnapped my brother and turned him into a monster that makes pills. That does sound crazy. You were there. You tell him. It's all true. It is true. Wait, you were there? You saw everything? She's telling the truth? Yep. And my dad, he was... Oh, jeez, I think I'm going to be sick. I'm sorry, Jerome. Thanks for helping me clear things up with him. I'll see you soon. Bye, Lily. Okay, we have a problem. Penny's coming up the stairs. I think she knows where I am. We need to get out of here now. What do we do? There's got to be another way out of here. Help me find a way or we're all dead. This air vent looks like it'd be unscrewed. Unscrew the vent. That's perfect. Come on, guys. We've got to go. Follow Lily. Yep. We should be safe here. She won't be looking for long. What now? I'm going to head back down to Billy. We still have a lot of work to do. I'm sure there's something you can do in here. To wait the time out before recess. Okay. Good luck. And Jerome, I'm sorry. Change the lesson plan to robotics. What the? How did you get into my science classroom? Explain yourselves. We snuck in through the vent. Oh, that's rather clever. Not clever enough to avoid study hall, but still clever. Oh, man. Look at all the bad children today. My word, there are a lot of you. To make matters worse. <sighs> I didn't get my coffee. My fellow Americans, no one move or talk. Just, <sighs> just be quiet. Say nothing. I said no moving. All right, we have to wait. I'm stupid. <laughs> that happens in the first. It happens. Yeah, not in the. <sighs> Actually, it doesn't. It doesn't. I was about to say that happens in the first game. Then I realized this man's only in the second game, and so I'm now I'm like, oh right, it's been such a long time since we've been to study hall in this game that I just forgot. I'm just going to close my eyes real quick. Okay, then. Did you work through your issues, Jerome? I guess I did. I'm still processing it all, but I feel a little better. Good. So you're okay with parting with that little device of yours? Oh, I already did. I think I left it on the bathroom floor upstairs. Great. Okay, kid. Let's go up and grab that thing. What about Danner? What about him? Guy didn't get his coffee today. He'll sleep like a baby until the bell rings. We'll be fine as long as we're back when he wakes up. Let's go. Carla is so competent. <laughs> what are you rotten kids doing up here? We're looking for a little device that was left on the ground. Have you seen it? <laughs> Maybe I have. What's in it for me if I tell you? I don't know. What do you want? Well, the cafeteria needs some cleaning spray since you little hooligans tore it up. And the toilet paper needs replacing in the boys' room. We can do that. Good. Come back when you do. Be right back. We steal one of them. Never mind. I don't have the spray. How do I get both the spray? How do I get the spray? What prize did you pick for taking your assessment today? The toilet paper. Cool, I got the spray bottle. Head on down to the boys' bathroom and drop drop that off. Meet me back here as soon as possible. Got it. Hey, dude, what's up? Never mind, nothing. Here's some toilet paper. 
Oh yeah, I'll take care of it. Thanks, dude. You can go now. There you are. Drop off the toilet paper, right? Yep. Awesome. Let's go to that device from the old. Get the device from the old coot. We're gonna blow the lid off this play place. You do I'm doing my job for me? You bet. Good. Maybe you kids aren't ba all bad after all. Maybe I shouldn't hit so many of you with my mop. That would have been nice. Well then, you can leave me alone now. What about the device? The what? Oh yeah, the little doodad. I put it in the weapons closet. It's under my cleaning cart. Baba left the door unlocked. It looks like he was tripping in on something in there. You don't even have it with you? Come on, man. Deal with it, kid. I'll let the whole kid know to let you in. Now get out of here before I change my mind about hitting kids with my mouth. Well, let's head down there. We're almost out of time. Whoa, it's pretty... <coughs> Hard to breathe in here. Once I blow a hole in the wall, it'll air out. Probably snap Bob out of his little trance. That'll be good. Get that device, get out of here. If we stay too long, we'll end up like him. Got it. Uh. Jerome's device is in this cart's bag. Take it. <coughs> I don't know how much longer we can last like this. We gotta get the heck out of here. And then we go back to class. Good stuff, kid. Now we just need to get back to our seats and wait for the bell to ring. Okay, don't forget to pay your lab fee. I'll see you in science class. Got it. Uh. Huh? What? Uh oh. My fellow Americans, I must have dozed off for a moment there. Uh, right. Anyone who wants to come to science class, come pay your lab fee. Otherwise, go to gym. Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about robotics. That's odd. I thought it was about plants. Anyway, robots are a wonderful way to terrorize the tri-state area. In front of you is one of my fellow kinds of robot. Favorite kinds of robots. The hydraulic press. Do we have any volunteers to stick their head under it? Anyone? You kids are no fun. Just go stick those spare parts together until something light lights up. Time to break this sucker down. We need to deactivate the triggering mechanism so it doesn't blow our heads off. How do we do that? That's a good question. Maybe someone from your old school has experience dealing with this sort of thing. Yeah, Monty, Monty has robotics. My fellow kinds of robot. Yeah, I... <laughs> Yeah, robots are cool and all, but none of the stuff in here in this class comes to comes close to what I've made. Can you deactivate this? You know I can, but you also know I won't be doing it for free. How much? Twenty bucks. That's so expensive. Yeah. Sort my medical bills. Now put up or shut up. Is there anything else I can do? Hmm. Maybe there is something. I've seen you hanging out with Carla all day. Are you on good terms with her? I guess so. Good, good. So what you do... What? <laughs> good, good. So what do you say you drop a good word about her, meet it for her? Maybe set up us on a little date. I can try. Well, you better try hard. Either you can give me $20 or you can set me up on a date with her. Got it? Got it. Well, do you find? did you find anyone to do it? Monty will. Okay, so why isn't he doing it? He wants to be your boyfriend. Ugh, that grimy little... You know what? Fine, but I'm not happy about it. Okay, then. Did you ask her? What did she say? She said yes. Ha! Diggity dog! I can't wait! I'll be a force to be reckoned with. We'll be a force to be reckoned with. About the device. Oh, yeah. This'll just take a minute. There, I disabled the listener on it. It won't pop unless you give it a, a different method of exploding. Thanks, Monty.
Just hurry up and tell the little dweeb that I'll be his girlfriend. We need to get a move on. It's done. Great. Can't wait for this date. Let's get crushing. Push the button. Oh, <laughs> I didn't realize I had to walk up onto it. Place the device. My fellow Americans, another day of learning concluded. Please don't break anything on the way out. Wait, we didn't do everything. What happened? Wait, no! What the fuck? No! What the fuck? What happened? How did I run out of apples? What the fuck? What? What? I am so confused. What the fuck happened? How did I run out of apples? What on earth? What the actual fuck? Uh, okay. Let's try and do everything all over again. I don't know what happened. Uh, yeah, I have no idea what just happened. I literally don't know even know what happened right there, or why I ran out of apples, or how I'm supposed to not run out of apples. Oh, it's because I- oh, I fucking realized now. It's because it took an apple to use the crusher once. Oh god, I- that's fucking annoying, but okay. spray this time. Oh, right, after. Wait, no, we can't do that, because then she has to go to the boys' bathroom. So we can't take the spray bottle. It has to be the toilet paper. I thought I took the blahage. Oh, I took the... Oh my god, I'm so fucking annoyed. <laughs> I thought I took the blahage. Fucking god damn it. Jesus fuck all Christ. Okay. Oh wait, whoops. <laughs> I, uh, I skipped through the dialogue too quickly and now he's gonna murder me.
Oh. I'm gonna fucking lose my mind. All right. So this cutscene again, if you could call it a cutscene. experience a food fight in middle school. I have no idea how it really works. Probably is just one of those myths and legends from, uh, like, media talks about food fights in schools all the time, but it probably almost never happens. I'm a victim of skipping through dialogue. I don't think they're real, to be honest. Yeah, it just feels like a lot of... Uh, work that a bunch of kids would have to go through with. 
in order to make themselves be willing to do something like that. Give the toilet paper to the hall monitor. Study all, study all, study all. Okay, finally. Garden, right? They're like four or five years old, right? Maybe it's five or six? Why do they- why would- why are their brains at a point where they're like, yeah, let's date? Like, what? God, why are they even in a science class at this age? Oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Okay, place the device, push the button, there we go, logic.bin not found. You did it, this is exactly what I need to finish the bomb, I can totally blow open that wall now. Hooray! Ah, my fellow Americans, another day of learning concluded, please don't break anything on the way out. Leave without breaking anything. Yay! We did Carla's mission! What a day! I can't believe we were able to build this thing so quickly! You you know what? The cherry- you know what the cherry on top? Want to know the cherry on top? What? I had enough parts to make two bombs! How sick is that? You can have one for yourself! Oh wow! If it uses Penny's tech, she won't recognize it as contraband. So have fun with that. I'm sure we'll be working together again soon. Yeah, maybe. You can also have this Monster Mod card. I'm just that impressed. Later, kid. Later. See, Monty thinks he's gonna get with Carla, but actually we are gonna get with Carla. Things that go boom. Ofaka Tornado. I remember that from the first game. <laughs> Ofaka Tornado. It's a green card though, so I'm not really gonna I'm not gonna use it. Two damage, plus two damage if you last discarded a green card. Eh, it's not bad, it's just I don't really have many green cards. I have a lot of red though. Quite a lot of red. Oh man. I guess we start on our mission to uh I guess we try to just start doing this. So we need the bomb, the blahage, and the uh, breaking sat, and whatever the thing, the object is we got from that. Start the mission by buying a battery and then using the remote on Penny. All right, cracking my neck open in a million, in a million pieces now. Let's see if we can actually finish this game. A fact: an earthquake and. Oshida Hurricane for Natural Disaster Tribal.
you know, green is degenerate, but I'm never gonna gonna really fault a red green deck for just running ramp and then earthquake and uh, and hurricane, <laughs> and that's all they do. I can't really fault them for doing that because that's just funny. So we need the Blahaj, the remote, and the bomb. Another outfit I got? No, not really. Just, uh... I have Lily's dress. Or Penny's dress. And then this one is funny. I'll just keep my, uh, jacket. Let's see if we can finish the game. Oh! Oh, oh, dear, this is embarrassing. What's wrong, Miss Applegate? I seem to have uh, misplaced that really, really important thing you gave me at orientation. Holy shit. This confirms that we are literally a time traveler. This confirms by lore in game that we are a time traveler. Because before, you could previously sort of ascertain that it's just like a game mechanic where we're getting access to these items beforehand. And in theory, like, we could have come to school the first day with them. But this actually confirms in the lore that it is actual time travel. That's what this confirms. We actually snatched the, bu the remote from... Uh, from time and space, and we took Miss Applegate's remote as a result. So that means that all the time travel shit in this game of us repeating the same day, that's actually a part of the lore. It's not just a game mechanic. Which is really fucking cool, if I'm gonna be honest. I think that's very cool. Hopefully it's explained in Kindergarten 3. Ah, uh, that's okay. I'll get you another one by lunchtime. We'll search all the students as they come in to make sure none of them have it. Bob, make sure you te check everyone who's going up the ramp for any special devices. Uh, sure. What kind of special devices? You'll know when you see it. Thank you. Penny, please start, um, looking for Miss Applegate's special device. Yes, Mommy. I'll just do what I'm looking for. I should be able to find it before the bell rings. We need to buy a battery. So let's read the mission again. Okay, we use the remote. Hello, my name is Penny. My mommy is the principal. You must be one of the new kids. It's so nice to meet you. Use the remote. Calibrating insufficient power from source to established link. Place battery in remote. Command received. Oh, Penny, please don't do... Penny! I'm sorry. I... I don't know what came over me. I think someone is getting beneath your skin. Keep looking for that special device. Yes. Yes, mummy. I'm always right. I'm almost ready to find it. Um, am I still coming down from the pills? Or did that child just shoot lasers from her eyes? It's almost as cool as the time travel and endgame. Shut up! <laughs> oh, God. I mean, it's better in this game due to the fact that they don't try to explain it yet and they're not going to try and science fiction it out of the way like if, in the third game if the, if they explain it they'll just have it be a joke which is totally fine but it's when you try and take the time travel seriously and you completely ruin every single conceivable angle of what you're trying to do with it that it becomes a fucking problem Probably both. My daughter has some things she's working through right now. I assure you she will not cause one any more problems today. I'm sorry. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm sure we can still be friends. 
He was hoping. Nugget saw! Nugget saw the android girl shoot the bars! Nugget saw you pulling the strings. Right! With this power, Nugget knows you can bring peace to the school. How? Descend and speak with the pretty Lily. She will know what to do. Okay. Fox looks interesting. Squeak the plushie. It's us, Lily and Billy. We've been spying on this new school and we discovered a lot. Do you want to hear about it? You need... Well, actually, first I'll say sure. Sure. Well, it turns out that the three kids who were rezoned to another school weren't rezoned. They're here. They're deep under the school. That elevator has a secret eye scanner that gives you access to go way underground. I think they're using them for experiments like they did with me. We have to help them. What do you need? Our original plan was to tunnel down there with digging equipment, but that might take too long. Our other option is to get past the eye scanner. How do we do that? By getting Penny down here. She's a robot, which means she can be controlled. The teachers get these little remotes that control her. Which is also why the lights go out when the kids get sent to the principal's office. It's voice activated and calls Penny to take out the kid who's misbehaving. Right, so we need that remote. Can you get it for us? If not, we'll just have to start digging. I have it. This is incredible. How did you... It doesn't matter. With this, we can save those kids. We don't need this digging stuff anymore. So what now? We need to take out anyone else who has one of those remotes. If they find out we're using this one, they can use Penny to kill us. We need to take out anyone who has these remotes. So we have to kill all the other teachers. I think. Who else has the remotes? I unmuted myself, right? I, I, yes, I did. Okay. Who else has the remotes? Both teachers and the principal. We'll have to take them all out simultaneously. Once that's done, once that's done, we scan Penny's eye in the elevator. Go down and free those kids. We're gonna kill the teachers? I know it sounds harsh, but they're in on this. They know what's going on here, and they're allowing it to continue. They're just as guilty as the principal is. So what should I do? During morning time, start recruiting kids who can help us take out the teacher. We'll also need access to the principal during lunch, so try and do that before the bell rings. Oh boy. Oh, we'll also need access to the principal during lunch. We'll start talking to the kids in the smart class and see if we can get any of them on board. Sounds like a plan. Hurry up and get out of here. If you stick around, you'll blow our cover. Get out of here. <laughs> Mommy, I think Miss Applegate dropped the special device down a drain or something. Okay then, it's nothing to worry about. As long as no one else has it, everything is wonderful. Poor Penny. <laughs> it's a good thing nobody is going to find that remote. Someone could have gotten in trouble. Yep. Good thing. We need access to the principal. Okay. Now we have the, the pass to the principal during lunch. Tears make me feel bad for the android. I mean, I think Penny is a very legitimately tragic character. Because, like, she explains that she got into an accident. And then after that accident, her mother turned her into an android to use as a weapon of terror against other the all the other kids in the school for fear of death. So that she so that the principal in this school can cover up uh, her own experimentation on the Eldritch Liquid. You know? So, like, I think feeling bad for Penny is totally legit. Also, I think she might be a cyborg, technically, but I don't know. We'll see. Actually, we won't. I don't know if we do. Psst. 
Hey, hey kid, back here. Up here, kid. What are you doing up there? Don't worry about that. Lily is upstairs making some friends. We're gonna meet you. Need you to do the same. Who should I talk to? Anyone who would hold a grudge against Applegate. She's made a lot of kids angry at our school. I'm sure you'll find someone. What do they need to do? Applegate doesn't look too good. I'd guess she's about to puke. We should find a girl to take up one of the stalls in the girl's bathroom. That'll make it easy to get her. What else? We need someone to um, do the deed. Probably someone with stabbing experience. I'll ask around. Good, take this. Maybe you could use the robot girl to gain these kids' trust. I'll see you at lunch. What do the buttons do? Oh yeah, the green summons her. The blue drops her contraband. The yellow disables her laser and red fires it. Okay. Man, I'm not gonna remember this shit. Green summon, blue drop, yellow disable, stops us from dying, red kills someone. Okay. I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. I need your help to kill teacher. Whoa, whoa, whoa there, kid. Where's all this coming from? I mean... Yeah, I want the old cow dead, but I'm not getting blood all over my skirt. You just need to be in the bathroom. Oh, well in that case, I think I can make that work for a price. It'll just be the cost of you putting this in a girl's hair. I know how I love when a, you know how I love when the girls wear my gum. There aren't any girls here. Well, geez, you better find one then if you want my help. Okay, green summons her. Hug, what do you want, laser girl? I didn't call you. I, I don't know. I'm just supposed to be here. Wearing my gun. Yeah, she is a, she is disgusting. <laughs> Whatever, make yourself at home. Not like I can stop you. I think I'm supposed to talk to you. Why am I supposed to talk to you? Put gum in her hair. Hey, that was mean. I'm sending you to the... Press the yellow button. Oh, never mind. I'll just be going now. Bye, Penny! I don't even know what to say. That was the least satisfying hair gumming I've ever seen. But you'll still help, right? I guess so. God, I feel empty. You need help. Whatever, I'll do what you need. Just use the bathroom during lunch. Sure thing. What a waste of gum. Stop talking to Cindy. <laughs> I hate you. What do you want? I'm trying to business figure out how to get my knife back. I might have a way. What's that thing supposed to do? <laughs> uh, press the green button again. Go back again? What is with you? I thought this school had better technology than this. I don't know what's wrong with me. There's lots wrong with you. Just stay whatever course you're on, but I'm telling your mother about this. I think I'm supposed to talk to you. Why am I supposed to talk to you? Yeah, you're supposed to talk to me. Give me my knife back. Not you. Him. You're supposed to do something now. Blue drops the contraband. Here's the contraband I collected today. I'm going back to class now. Bye, Penny. That was super freaking weird. How is it possible this school is weirder than our old one? Do you want your knife back? Oh, yeah. Thanks, man. I owe you one. I need you to kill the teacher. <laughs> well, that's something I'd be willing to accommodate. I'm in. Just let me know what to do. Will do. Attention, new kids. Here's your passbook. If you get an adult to sign it, you're allowed out in the halls. Don't get any crazy ideas, though. You're only allowed to use it once per day. Got it. Oh, thank God. That's the bell. Get out of my classroom and go to lunch. Psst. Hey, kid. Over here. I saw Bugs and Cindy leave already. Good work. What happens now? Lily made friends with that Carla girl. They stole the listening device that Jerome was carrying around. 
Okay. Which means that when it hears my voice or name, it'll explode. Oh. <laughs> so when I signal her, she's gonna come over here and give you the device. You're gonna plant it under the table in the teacher's lounge. Sounds good. I'm not done yet. Once the device goes off, we're going to have a very limited amount of time before the staff is notified. You'll need to be upstairs when the lockdown takes place. Got it. Ha! Ha! <sighs> We're in a cafeteria, weirdo. There aren't any birds. You know, I was looking at this thing, and it turns out it would make a really solid base for my own little project. But we need it. Yeah, but there's nothing you can really do to stop me from keeping it. Unless you've got something better. I actually do. Whoa! This is perfect! It's exactly how I would have made it. Yeah, take this stupid little thing. I've got bigger fish to fry. Can you help us get into the lounge? Of course I could, but I'm not going to today. I'm going to need all the goodwill from the fa from the faculty I can get to pull this off. Then how can I get in there? I don't know and I don't really care. Find someone to dig your way. Dig your way in for all I care. I'll figure something out. To dig our way in. Okay, we need Nugget. I can't wait to blow the lid of the teacher's lounge. This is going to be incredible. <sighs> What's wrong, Nugget? Nugget was hoping to dig a new Nugget cave, but Nugget has no way to dig one. Will this help? Will this help? Will this help? Nugget can dig one million Nugget Caves with this! Nugget can dig straight to the center of the Earth! Please don't do that. Nugget's friend is right. No Earth means no Nuggets. Glad we agree on that. Nugget must hurry. There is much to do. Please come to visit Nugget in his new Nugget Cave. At recess. Will do. So much of a nugget cave as it is a nugget tunnel. It seems to lead somewhere. My fellow Americans, what part of you are not allowed in here is so hard for you to understand. Nugget understands the big man's head, the big head man's orders. Nugget just does not care. Nuggets, nuggets are far too important. You're lucky the principal forbid us from harming you. I'll deal with you in a moment. First, I have to get this weirdo out of here. This is a good spot to leave the device. Leave it. Nugget appreciates being able to use the microfave. Old nuggets are bad nuggets. They do not make for a suitable nug. Get out! Very well. Nugget is leaving. Don't think I didn't notice you that you're in here too. Get your inadequate self back through the hole you crawled in. That was a double negative. I'm a science teacher, not a grammar teacher. Now get out. Did you place the bomb under the table? Yes, I did. Good, because you've got another job. Lily just signaled that she needs help upstairs. You have to go help while I set off this bomb. Will do. You have a way upstairs, right? Yup. Good. Remember, we have to act quickly here. Don't wait around. Get ready to go. Let's go. I'm going to see the principal. Ah! My sister was to see you. I'm a child. Yep, yep. Hmm. It looks like something has been causing you to receive excess commands to excessive commands today. Your chip is defunct. What? What does that mean? Don't worry. We'll take care of it after school today. Now run along, mommy has a visitor. Okay, I'll be back if you need me. Please come in. So sorry about all that. Just helping my daughter through a tough time she's having. You okay? She'll be fine. Now then, I understand you have some concerns about. Oh dear, what was that? I'm not sure. I hope every. 
Sister! Something has happened! They made their move! Dr. Danner has been killed in the teacher's lounge! It's only been a few hours! Damn, they work fast! We have to hurry! Get the research and get out of here! Have Penny monitor outside! What the fuck? Thank goodness you're still here! Where else would I be? Something went wrong! Applegate has bugs! Please go help him! She's lost her mind! Okay, okay. We have to go to oh, right, the girls' bathroom. Nugget really appreciated that gift. Oh yeah, no kidding. I've wanted to do this for a long time, boy. A long, long time. Well, what are you waiting for? Do it already. I'm not afraid of you. Stab the teacher. Ah! You little bastard. Oh, you, if it's the last thing I... Man, that was a close one. Thanks for the save, kid. This whole place is going to hell. I've noticed. I heard something fat hit the floor. Oh, it wasn't bugs. Bite me, Cindy. Hey, guys, we're on lockdown. And now I can see why. Jeez, you guys are little savages. Are we in trouble? You would be, but there aren't really any adults left to punish you. What? Both teachers are dead. Bob, the principal, and the lunch lady are all missing. The other janitor doesn't really punish within the guidelines of the school anyway. No, he doesn't. So I'm just supposed to take you guys outside until the lockdown is over. Okay, then. Nuggets! <laughs> oh, this is lovely. Okay. Um, I don't remember if we have to talk to Penny or not, actually. There's no apples from s seeing the Nugget Cave. Okay. Behold! Nugget's new Nugget Cave! There is much to see and to... What a lovely surprise! Nugget's friends Lily and Billy are here. Nugget is quite impressed by Lily and Billy's sneakiness. We have a problem. Good to see you, too. There's a big scary monster near where we were hiding this morning. That's not good. No, it's not. We need to find some way to get by it. There has to be someone big and strong and brave enough to fight it or something. See if you can find anyone. Okay. Don't be afraid to use that remote to get back into the school. Maybe there's someone inside still willing to help us. I'll look around. Is Nugget's friend enjoying his stay at the Nugget Cave? Yes, but I'm ready to leave. We are on lockdown. We are on lockdown. No one is allowed in the school. Use the remote. I can't take this anymore! Oh no! Penny! That's why I think she's actually a cyborg, because she has some of these... Some of this intelligence left over that's like an emotional intelligence of some kind. So, like this... Yeah, man, you look way cooler now. It's just a shame we don't have a lighter for these. Whoa, sub lockdown this is. Hey, while you're here, do you have a lighter? I do. Awesome, bro. Thanks so much. Here's a Monstermon card for helping us out. Thanks. Yay, Monstermon card. Hey, man, I can't let you in there. Some wicked fumes are coming from that place. Fine. I have to... How do I get back? Hmm. I'm not using any apples changing rooms over and over again. There's Dr. Danner. This is a cool jacket. I wonder if it comes in my size. Maybe it does. His head was so big, he must have stored a lot of science in there. <laughs>
I think I have to go upstairs now. Cause we have to we have to vent the fumes. Oh, Miss Jiggly Tits, they jiggled their last. I always knew I'd have to clean up her body, just didn't think it'd be so soon. How sentimental. I feel like this isn't the first time I've stabbed her. Weird. Now I have her outfit. I don't know if that's a new Monster Mon card or not. I don't remember how to vent the fumes. She did get stabbed in the first game, but not in the canon ending. So I need, I need to vent the fumes. I don't remember how. I really, really do not know how to vent the fume. Like, Bob is in this closet here. If he's starting to come around, look at him having his first cigarette. Makes me proud. Yeah, what an arc. No point in me found the rules anymore. Look where that got us. Wait, 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 wait. Penny jumped in the hole. Maybe we go talk to Penny in the Nugget Cave, since it, it takes no apples to go into the Nugget Cave. That might be what we need to do. Hey, Penny. What are you fu- I, I don't want to do it anymore. Mommy, please, I don't wanna, I don't wanna. How do I... I don't remember how to vent it. Maybe I have to go here. Oh, Carla. Come on, you stupid door. <sighs> Budge, I need to blow up a wall! You look upset. I am upset! You gave me the perfect device to finally blow up in the wall between the janitor's closet and the teacher's lounge, and Penny won't let me into this stupid school to do it. Penny's gone. Really? Awesome, that means I can go do this. Thanks for letting me know, kid. No problem. Alright, she blows it open. She blows it open. And then that's how it gets vented. That sounded like it came from the teacher's lamp. I did it! This will make stealing stuff so much easier! Great. Ooh, something smells funny. Snap him out of it. Huh? What? What? What happened? Everything is fuzzy. Why am I here? There was a weird gas in here. Yes, yes there was. And it made me forget, but it's coming back. The monster! The axe is still bloody. I fought a monster yesterday, but it got away. No, it's it's still down there. I have to finish it off. It could hurt someone. Stay here, kid. I'm going to save the school. Godspeed, Bob. Charge! <laughs> Bob is probably the best, is probably the nicest character in this game. Time to win the game. Bob is in there fighting the monster now. We just need a way to break through to Penny. Got any ideas? I'll find something. Uh, let's go get her doll, I guess.
Take the doll. A lot of running around. I could have done quite a few of these things all at once, but I just didn't realize that that was how it was going to work. I don't want to do it anymore, Mommy. Please, I don't want to. You want this? My dolly! I used to play with her. Back before, before my mommy. My mommy turned me into this. Are you okay? No. No, I haven't been okay in a long time. But I think it is time I made things right. Okay, good. The elevator underneath the school has an eye scanner that grants access to the deeper levels. I'll take you there to confront my mommy. Sounds good to me. Good, let's go right now then. I'm not sure how much longer Bob can hold off that creature. Let's go. You horrible creature! I will not allow you to harm these children! I really hope he wins! He seems like a nice janitor! I know that's a low blar to clear considering our janitor, but you get what I mean! Okay, Benny, scan your eye! Let's go down there and save those kids! Okay, here goes! Woo! Well, here goes everything! Let's do this! Let's go! We got the squad! I don't think that's him, Madison. No! You kids have got, have to get out of here! That blonde girl is who put us in here! I'm sorry. I wasn't in control of my son. Why don't we save apol- Why don't we save apologies and explanations for after we've saved everyone and gotten out of here alive? Lily's right. How do we get you guys out of there? I don't know. Try pressing one of the buttons on here. See if that- <clears throat> Penny? What are these children doing unsecured in my secret lab? I'm here to... We're here to stop you! You can't do this anymore! I do not have the time for this! Penny, I'm sending all these children to the principal's office. Penny? Did you hear me? I said... Oh. Your chip fry, didn't it? That's quite unfortunate. That means you're useless to me. But... But... I'm your daughter! Mommy, please! No! Penny! And since I don't have a daughter to help me anymore... Looks like I'll have to test out the new mutator earlier than expected. Kill them! I have questions. Oh, well, I suppose since you're about to die, I can provide you with a few answers. What's with the monsters? Marvelous, aren't they? Children are so much easier to mutate than adults. Just a few more kids and I'll be able to take over the other schools in the area. What's the green stuff in the janitor's closet? It's produced by the monsters. Its properties are boundless. It creates a nice fuel that I can use to power Penny. But we're exposed her. She seems to cause memory loss. Why is Penny a robot? There was an incident. One of the creatures got out. Penny was severely wounded. I was able to put her back together with some improvements. You just blew her up. And I'll put her back together again with even more improvements. She'll be fine. What's wrong with the lunch lady? I get what you mean. But honestly, even I don't know. She's just like that. Okay, let's get this over with. Okay, then. Kill them! Ah! Help! It's got my leg! Get it off! Hang on, Lily, kid! You've got to help her! Take out the thing that's eyeing you! And then save Lily! What about you? I'll be fine! Just save Lily! Okay. So, we have a green... We have a green hook. A red hook. Oh! If I try to, like, walk around too much, he just kills me. Okay. Oh, fuck. I have to go through all this again. Uh... Oh, the green claw is in the middle. Good work, kid. Now find a way to get the thing off Lily now. Right. Wait, what? Oh! 
Okay, I have to move the okay, I have to move the claw first and then We're going overtime just to finish this. <laughs> and then tomorrow we do Monstermon. Move it right. What? Wait, what? I have to kill it immediately? But how do I do that? Do I use... Do I have to use Penny's eye lasers? I think that's what I have to do. Because I don't know what else to do. me to save her. Press the red button. Thanks for the help. Any longer and I feel like you would have swallowed me whole. Let's find a way to help Billy. I'm not sure how much longer that box will hold. I'm on it. So blue claw. Left. Press the button. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now let's get that nasty principle. This is unacceptable. I will not tolerate insubordination in my school. Activate Goo Cannon. We've got to make her call off the cannon or else we're going to be wearing whatever that stuff is. Thank you for giving my death meaning. You're welcome. The Goo Cannon. Oh, wait, the red one can just immediately get it, right? Hey, stop. Unhand me immediately. Oh, dear. Fire goo cat! We... we failed! What do you mean? We set out to save these kids from that awful woman, but look around, they're all dead! Come on, Lily, we did our best. We should get out of here. There are other schools we can... What? What was that? I don't want to know. Oh no, it's a giant penis monster! What even is that thing? How do we fight something like that? What are we gonna do? It's a pageant. It's a pageant. <laughs> it's a pageant. <laughs> Close her mouth. She won't be hurting us now. She looks terrified. So let's get out of here. Not so fast, kid. Look. It looks like the ceiling's about to collapse or something. Maybe we, we get her to look up. It'll crash right through that big, ugly eye. I suppose it's worth a shot. I don't know if I use blue. I think I use red, maybe. Let's see. Nugget is here! Nugget will save the pretty Lily! <laughs> Nugget! Is... is he alive? Nugget is alive! Nugget did good, right? The monster was no one's friend. You did great, Nugget. Thank you for saving us. Nugget is happy to have the pretty Lily's gratitude. Perhaps this would make a good Nugget cave. It's all yours, Nugget. I just want to go home. I'm still sad about... Yuck! This stuff is so gross. It's so slimy. Let's get out of here. I'll take being slimy over being a monster any day. You're alive! This wasn't all for nothing. I'm so happy. We did good today, Lily. Especially you, kid. Thanks. Come on, let's all go home. Go home. Woo! Now we just have to get Monster Mon cards tomorrow. Oz 
was he? What? Who said that? I don't know the voice for any of these kids. Madison, I thought you didn't go to the school anymore. Uh, what are you covered in? Oh, it's a weird slime from the principal's secret lab. Gross. Why don't we pick this up after you've had a bath? Oh, okay, I'll call you tonight then. This whole day has been so crazy. I'm glad we were able to save everyone and stop that awful principal. So what now? Well, I don't want to go home. I'm not really sure where home is. What do you mean? I don't even go to the school. I was brought here. All I remember is going down the slide at my school and then I woke up in that lab. That's weird. Yeah, I'm going to try and get home now. I'll see you guys around maybe. Bye, Alice. I want to get going too. My mom is probably worried about me. Thanks for saving my life and stuff today. No problem, Ron. I get must also leave. Nugget has business to attend to. I don't even want to know what that means. Um, Nugget, before you go, I just wanted to say thank you for saving us today. You were really brave. Nice. Nice. The, the pretty lily has kissed Nugget's cheek. Nugget. Nugget. Nugget is so happy! Nugget must tell the world! The three of us make a pretty good team. Yeah, we do. So what now? I don't know. I just know I'm ready to go home. Sounds fair. Before we go, though, we want you to have this Monster Mon card. It's pretty rare. There's only two in existence. Interesting. You can also have this. It's a guide that we made of all the Monster Mon cards and outfits we found hidden around the school. Neat. That's it, then. Let's go home. Goodbye. Bye. Woo! Creature feature. Help Lily and Billy save the captured kids. Continue. My god. <laughs> Cigarette Mon, Dank Ma Dark Dank Magician. Oh my god. Woo! Okay. We've technically beaten the main plot of this game, but we must still assemble all of the talismans of the Monster Mon cards. And then we will get the secret ending. And then we will be done with the game. I don't know how long it'll take tomorrow, but that's what we'll be doing. And it'll be a nice and good time that will hopefully take exactly two hours and not put us under or over two hours. Even more, though, I want to, like, uh, really optimize the deck. The Monster Mon deck. Emotional support animals. Cooper Link, Eevee, Mookie. Oh, okay, cool. Normalize putting people's pets in the credits. Who cares if you, it's like it's just, it's negligible extra lines of text. But yeah, yeah, this game is, uh, I like this game series, and the moment the third one comes out, we're gonna play it new and uh, see how things go because I enjoyed this and I, I'm gonna enjoy the next one. Hopefully the next one has even more Monster Mon mechanics. And uh, that we're not completely retarded when we try and figure out the puzzles for ourselves. So real quick, I want to go and I want to... I want to go to my Monster Mon deck box. Congratulations on saving everyone. Lily and Billy have given you a guide that tells you where the rest of the unlockables in the game are. Cool. You can see a locked card's location by hovering over it in the Monster Mon collection screen. Same with outfits after interacting with the wardrobe. Good. New red card, Cigarette Mon. Deals two damage, reduces a green Monster Mon by three. Okay. Might use that. It's only two damage, though. It's just shock. Like, I wouldn't want to replace it, like, for a killer eye or anything, like, you know. Okay, so as, as awesome as Marshmallow is, we're not in this for Marshmallow. We're in here for Red. Dank Magician. Oh, this is the one that... This is the 8 damage 5... <laughs> this is the one that the fucking... We got nuked with by the by uh, the, the lady. Uh, the dumpster lady, and then... <laughs> And then we killed her with our burn spells. That's cool. But yeah, so we can just go to this screen and just uh, find out where they all are. And that'll be fun. And that'll be what we do tomorrow. 
I don't care as much about the outfits, if I'm going to be honest, but I guess we could maybe go looking for them. Oh, wait. Let's get the lab coat for next time. Yeah. Oh, I, I am so I am so professional looking. But OK, that's uh, going to be it for today, everyone. That's uh, going to be it. Thank you all very much for joining me here tonight. I really appreciate you coming here and hanging out with me. We will be back tomorrow. We're going to continue with this game. We did beat it, but we need to get, we need to get all of the, of the Monster Mon cards so that we can get the secret ending inside the Nugget Cave. That'll be a bit technical, but that's what we'll be doing. Hopefully it won't take too long or too short. Um, if you happen to be new here and you enjoyed hanging out with us today, if you think I deserve a follow, I'd appreciate that quite a bit. We stream three times a week for approximately two hours. And this stream uh, will be re-uploaded to YouTube tomorrow night, where we'll join every single stream I've ever done. So if there are any you want to catch up on, you can find all of them there. Link is in the About section. And yeah, we went way over time just to finish the game. So we are well beyond our normal time range. So I'm going to check out let y'all go and uh so yeah uh thank you all very much for being here i appreciate your support in every capacity i hope you have a good afternoon evening morning etc i will see you all again tomorrow with more kindergarten 2. ciao